Good morning everyone, welcome to another Beck's Life vlog. I'm doing a two day vlog today because I'm off today and tomorrow and I attempted a weekend vlog at the weekend and pretty much everything that I was planning to vlog sort of fell through or just didn't go according to plan. So <laughs> we're trying again because I was really looking forward to like a nice vlog vibe and just being able to yeah just chat and vlog and a lot of things just fell through so we're going again today i feel like i say it's in every vlog but it's going to help me be accountable as well because there's stuff that i want to get done and hopefully you'll enjoy watching it whilst i do it but i just feel like i've been close to getting into a bit of a rut and i'm really trying not to get close to that point so i i'm gonna vlog and we're gonna be productive and we're gonna avoid rotting no that's a bit of an intense one i'm not that bad but i just feel like i'm just you know close to the line of going through a rough time so we're just gonna avoid that with a little vloggy vlog and a bit of productivity let's get into it enough of thing i'm about to go to the gym i've got on a new set i've got this orange sports bra from able that i just bought and these blue shorts that you can't see but you can sort of see them in the mirror actually <laughs> And I'm about to go to the gym. I'm doing uh, glutes and hammies today. However, um, someone that I speak to at the gym all the time, she is so sick. Like, she's so strong and she's just sick at all the moves she does. She's going to help me today to do a clean, I think this called. Where you get the bar and you're like... Hup. She was doing them on her story yesterday and I was literally trying to do them yesterday. So I messaged her and I was like, oh my god, this is so weird. I was trying to do them today and I was going to ask you for some help. And she was like, if you're in tomorrow, I'll show you. And I was like... Ah. Thick. so my aim is glutes and hammies but obviously this lovely lady from my gym is going to be helping me with some cleans today so we'll see i've been doing my vintage thing which is something else i need to do so let's see if i get it done in this vlog i need to upload more stuff to vintage because i was going to a festival on sunday which is what i was trying to vlog and it just epically failed and i tried on loads of like my festively outfits from previous years and i was like i just don't like any of these anymore so that's what happens when you buy micro trends. So I will be selling them on Vinted. But I've got to send this top that I've just sold and some cargoes that I've just sold as well. So let's go do that and then head to the gym and have a productive slay a day. Oh my God, I'm so hot right now. I've literally just left the gym and I'm just sweating so bad. It's a really nice day today though, which I'm grateful for. I'm gonna put the roof down in a minute. And I've done some power cleans. No, hand cleans. Hand cleans because they didn't come from the floor. I learned that today. Um, I had such a good workout. I've actually not finished my thing. Let's see. I was in there an hour and 39 minutes. But I burned 827 active calories, 994 total. Banging. I'll absolutely take that. I'm going to go home now, have a shower. Hopefully, I'll go see Emmy. I'm just about to ring Bill's mum and see what she's up to today. Maybe I'll go see Emmy. Because I haven't seen her in like a month, which is just crazy. It's like the longest I've gone without seeing her since she, she was born. So chuffed with that workout. Also, obsessed with this sports bra I got from Abel. And it goes so well with my gym shorts. I just wish I was at the level of confident to just wear sports bra and gym shorts to the gym. But unfortunately, I'm not. So I've literally just taken my sweaty ass t-shirt off. I'm just going to lay it like dry on the passenger seat. Sounds really gross. It's on top of my gym bag on the passenger seat. Oh god, no way that I sound. It doesn't sound gross. I wish I could drive and vlog, but I just my camera falls every time. But I feel like I have the best little chit chats when I'm driving. But I haven't got a carpool karaoke setup, so here we go. Um, yeah, I think I might put the roof open. Maybe not completely down. I've got my sunglasses though, which is a bummer. I've got first world problems. I've taken my car sunglasses out of the car. Oh, I can't have the roof down. I wish you could see what you're balanced on right now because I have so many tripods and I've literally balanced you on everything but slay. So as you can tell I've had a shower, I've washed my hair and I don't know why I've put a jumper on and pyjama trousers because it's literally warm outside but I need to eat and I need to have my greens. Now I've filmed about three different videos talking about having my greens within a vlog and then not posted it so let's see if this one actually makes it to the internet because I have a habit of filming vlogs and then going nah it's not that good and then just not posting it which is really silly and a waste of time so these are the greens that I have they're the free sole greens and typically what I do is put them in a glass get a lemon and I use a whole lemon I don't mess about and use one half I use the whole lemon and I squeeze the halves in 
and then I put water in it and that makes it taste a bit better. But something I've done twice now and it's quite enjoyable and more filling um, is to put it within my smoothie. So I'm going to do that today because I'm really hungry. So I'm going to have breakfast and a smoothie because if I'm heading out, I probably won't eat until dinner now. So I'm going to treat myself to a smoothie. So I've got frozen berries, summer fruit, and in an 80 gram serving is 26 calories. So I'm really not too crazy with weighing these out because there's not much in it at all. And obviously fruit's good for you. So, oh, may as well finish the whole bag. Do you know what I mean? Oh, I have finished the whole bag. Lol. Okay, so I've got that much fruit. Again, I'm not fussy with how much fruit I have because it's fruit, you know? As long as I'm not having like 500 a day. But then I get a teaspoon of my free soul greens and I just zhuzh that in there. So you can see there's bits of green. Now, I'm not going to lie, the free soul greens taste like absolute not good. But it's good for you. And we're going to make it taste okay. And obviously I'll get some milk. So you never ever want to have the free soul greens like on their own. Like just water. If you do that, I'm so sorry that you have to experience that. You will be traumatized. I have made that mistake before. It tastes like pond water. Or oh, I have a feeling this is gonna be a runny smoothie, and I like my smoothies thick. <laughs> Breakfast is served, avocado on toast. I was gonna make eggs, but I was just being too lazy. And smoothie. Right, so I'm back in the car. Absolutely roasting hot in here. And I'm about to go to Bill's to see Emmy. I've not put any mascara on and I feel so weird because I don't have my lashes tinted and I've got no mascara on and I normally have one or the other. But I'm not wearing any mascara at the minute because I woke up on Monday. So Sunday I went to a festival, woke up Monday and my eye was all like, well not, it wasn't really crusty but it was a little bit crusty and I was like, oh my God, do I have conjunctivitis? So I went home because I was at Bill's house, went home. And my mum was like, oh, you can get over the drop counters, over the counter drops. And I just didn't go get any. And then I was like, oh, shit, I'm going to wake up tomorrow. It's going to be fucking awful, isn't it? I woke up the next day, it was fine. And now it feels fine, but I just really don't want to risk it. So I'm just not wearing mascara today. So it's today's Wednesday. So I thought, let me give it a couple of days, you know? So if I look weird in today's vlog, that's probably why I have to fucking get this car and it's so hot. Let's go see Emmy. <sighs> What have you got, Emmy? Have you got a cornetto? Mmm, say yummy, yummy. <laughs> You're so cute. <laughs> say cheese. Cheese. Welcome to Thursday. I have slightly woken up on the wrong side of the bed this morning. I'm not going to lie to y'all. Um, no, I just, my body is aching. I definitely did too much yesterday, which is ironic because I barely vlogged it. But I ended up burning 1,400 active calories yesterday, 3,000, two or 400 total, something like that. Like crazy, like way over my normal. And I definitely didn't eat enough to account for that. So my body is aching and I went to the gym and I had a rubbish workout. So I'm just feeling a bit rubbish today. I think the reason I pushed myself so much yesterday is because I was feeling a bit rubbish yesterday. And I'm trying to avoid that is what I said at the start of this vlog. And I'm just not doing a very good job at that. Um, yeah, I'm just feeling a little bit low actually. I think I'm due on. So it makes sense. But I'm also getting increasingly frustrated with like I'm trying to find a job and... I am not being very successful <laughs> and it's just getting a bit worrying, frustrating, stressful, give me anxiety. Um, but I'm not going to talk about it because I will cry and I don't want to do that. So I'm going out now. I'm taking myself out because normally I just sort of stay at home and I like do stuff like clean my room or just well mostly just clean my room to be honest like do something to keep myself busy at home but it's so easy for me to then just sit on my bed and scroll tiktok and stuff so i'm actually gonna take myself out i think i'm gonna go to dunelm i'd love to go to some charity shops but i just don't know where there's any good ones there's like tons of charity shops near me like in my local high street but they're so rubbish so i think i'm gonna go to dunelm and then maybe i'll see if there's any charity shops in that area because it's a little bit further from me because i want a vase 
and i know that sounds really random but i want a vase for my room so we're gonna head out but get me out the house we're off i'm so hot in here i need to stop vlogging in this fucking heat with the roof not down see i want something pink i want something like these but bigger because obviously my room's not very big so i don't want like a huge one but i think pink would be good because it will go with the stuff in my room like my pillows and stuff or i'm a better off just going clear these are some funky ones got loads of little funky stuff there so i could just go really simple and get something like that that's just clear Pink. People probably think I'm talking to myself, and I kind of am. I quite like this, where it's like got that that look is the best I could describe. But this is way too big, and I've got my heart on pink now. Should I just go clear? I like this one. But it's a bit small. It is cream. Like these are just, just want a bit bigger. I really like this one. I just wish it was in pink. Because I really like the shape of this one and it'd probably be the perfect size for my room. Like I like the height and everything. But that colour will not go with my room. I have a feeling this is gonna be a bust. And I don't want to buy one just for the sake of buying one. You know? So guys, I'm home. I did not get a vase. I did not get a vase. I did get a really cool blanket though that I've wanted for ages. Because it was on sale. How exciting. But for now, I'm just sorting out so much stuff to put on vintage. So let me show you what I've got. I've got so much. This pile of stuff that's been on my desk. So this is stuff that I forgot to return or don't want anymore. So like these trousers are from ASOS. I just forgot to return those. But like, this is the pile that I've just made now. I've just made this pile of stuff in my wardrobe. This is a top from Shein that I really like but it doesn't fit me. And to be honest I don't know when it's going to fit me. So may as well sell it. So now for the boring bit of taking all the pictures of everything. I hate this bit. So I'm going to put on some music. I can't remember what I tell vlogs and what I don't because as I already mentioned, I I am terrible for making vlogs and then not uploading them because I'm like, mm, could be better, which is just me being stupid. So I can never remember what I've said and what I haven't, but... In case you didn't know, I've been learning Swedish. I mean, I've been learning Swedish for ages. I've definitely mentioned that before, but I've been listening to Swedish music. The only reason I'm not sure if I've mentioned that is because in Zanti I was making all the girls listen to Swedish music and they were hating every second of it. <laughs> but it's so good. So let's put on some Swedish music because I've not really been learning my Swedish lately. This one's Bra for Day. Bra for Day. Okay, like that. Uh, and it's Estraden and Victor Lexel. I like Victor Lexel. I like her as well, to be fair. Um, I've literally got four songs on this playlist called Swedish. Let's go. Me I'm Bra for Day. This is my favourite one. You ready? Det är nåt som vi tappat. Nej, inte för sjunde. I'm rusty. I'm so rusty. Det är nåt som vi tappat. Nej, inte för sjunde. Oh my god, guys! I've been cleaning my room, and I'm on a mission. I've just changed my bed. And I've like deep cleaned everything, like dusted, hoovered, mopped everything, moved my bed around. I've been sweating profusely. I've listed 22 items on Vinted. Don't even get me started. Um, and yeah, I feel much better for it. I've just got a pile of clothes in my bed that my mum's just given me from the line. But I want to show you my blanket. This is the blanket I got. It was meant to be £49 and I got it for £24.50, which I thought was a bargain. It's one of those like, big, thick ones. So I'm not going to put it on until winter because it's definitely not the season. But I've got this basket from Pretty Little Thing that I've never used. Let me show you. Like this. And it's been at the end of my bed. It's meant to be like a blanket basket. Um, and I'll be honest, I don't think the blanket's going to fit in it. This is the Freya blanket from Dunelm. But it's just not going... Oh, oh, there's card within it. Okay, we're revisiting, we're revisiting. Right. Oh, let's take it out. I haven't even seen the blanket yet. I thought I'll just wait till winter, but maybe I should look at it first. Wow, wow, we tell you what, it's a fair bit thinner without the uh, cardboard in it. Let's go hang it back on the door and see how it goes. Right, I'm probably gonna make it look cuter, but it will do. 
just here's my little basket and it's just gonna go at the end of my bed i just need to make sure it doesn't get dusty because everything that goes like down that end of the bed always gets really dusty quickly it doesn't actually look as cute as i thought it was gonna look just it's just there okay so i've just realized i've got my retainers in okay you're just gonna still be sounding lispy or should i take them out oh i don't know i have my retainers in so i'm gonna sound a bit different because i'm ready for bed now and i've got work tomorrow so i'm gonna go to bed read my book chill and then rue the day tomorrow <laughs> my bed is all nice and changed i hate changing my bed it's the biggest chore the only place i didn't quite 100 percent tackle is my desk however most of the stuff is off of it so that's good and i've already started selling stuff on vintage guys so happy about that anyway that is enough waffling for me thank you for spending the last two days with me hope you've enjoyed this vlog i'm gonna try and do more vlogs i know i always say this but i love vlogging it's my favorite thing to do way more than a sit down video anything like i love vlogging and then i always just get paranoid that i'm like making a vlog and people are gonna be like why are we vlogging this why are we watching this and i get worried people are gonna be bored um but then i see like tiktoks about like you know um vlog diaries and like you know but then i see tiktoks about like people making video diaries and stuff and i'm like this is what i want to do so i'm gonna do it and you know hopefully you enjoy it but yeah thank you for spending the last few days with me maybe by the next vlog i will have a vase if not we need to go vase shopping you're coming with the girls but i will see you in the next video bye <laughs>